Hello guys! Once again, this is uh, another episode of The Mamagaling Sa Math. Now, this time, what I would like to share with you is how to find the median of ungrouped data. So, the other time, the other video, we did uh, finding the average or the mean. Now, this time, we're going to do the median. So, if you wanted to find out more of the videos that I am going to upload, then you may click the notification bell to be notified all the time. And at the same time, you can also subscribe to my channel and that's why you're supporting and at the same time, uh, getting updated also of whatever videos that I'm going to post. So again, let's go and let's solve video. So, welcome to our example for the median. So, you notice, oh well, this is just a recycled question. So, you notice it's a mode because I then use this one for the mode. Let me just change this one to median. Okay? Sorry. Uh, middle score or uh, median. So, find the middle score or the median of the ages of nine middle management employees of a certain company and these are the ages of the nine middle uh, management employees so quickly our median this is the notification normally you have MD for population and then you have X tilde this is for sample so we are asked ask now to find the x tilde for the middle the nine middle management uh, employees of the certain company well i can give you a long explanation yes and with the formula but it doesn't matter there is a, a shorter and an easier way of doing it how there are things that you need to consider in identifying the median. First step is, okay, step one is we array the data, meaning to say we have to arrange the data from highest to lowest or lowest to highest. It doesn't matter so long as you arrange it. So in this case, let us arrange it in ascending order. So from lowest to uh, highest or from the, the youngest to the oldest uh, in age of the employees. So let's start from the youngest. Our youngest here is, okay, you have 45 years old, followed by 46 years old, and then, sorry, that is 45, 46. Then you have 48 years old, and then you have next is 51 years old. Okay, you have 53 years old then you have 55 years old then you have 58 years old and then 59 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 wow I missed one sorry oh there's 54 so 54 I'll just insert it here okay so I already already the data from uh, least to greatest now this is important you have to remember that you in the case of your n your sample size if your n or sample size is even okay you have to approach it in a different way if your n is odd you have also to deal it in a different manner now in this case our n is 9 for there are nine entries so that means to say it falls under odd case of uh, sample size so with that what you're going to do is just simply pair it look for the middle score so example this one you have this is pair this is pair this is pair and basically this is pair so you have now left with one middle score right that is one two three four one two three four so meaning to say from uh, from the score 53 
left of which there are four scores below it and there are also four scores above it that is eight and then plus the middle score 53 which is uh, the ninth score so with that this is our this is our median 53 so that's how to get the median another case is for example we are in the data let's say you have 45 46 48 51 53 54 55 years old 58 years old 59 years old and let's say uh, a retiring uh, employee so in this case uh, n here is 10 so it's already under even so we have even number of um, observations so with that if we're going to pair this this is pair 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 so we have two middle score the two middle score here is 53 and 54 years old now to find for the median or the x tilde we should simply combine get the average the the two middle score or the two middle entry 53 plus 54 and since there are two we get divided by two so what we're going to do now is okay so we will add now the two middle score 53 plus 54 divided by 2 so we have this result so the result here is 107 over 2 now if we are going to approximately get the quotient of 107 divided by 2 that is uh, 53.5 so in other words our median for this data set is 53.5 so the middle or the middle um, age of the 10, in this case 10 uh, middle management employees of the certain company is 53.5 years old. So that is how we find the median or get the median of a given data set. You should always remember, first step is you array the data whether ascending or descending order once done you have to consider now your sample size whether it's odd or even if it's odd then basically you will get the middle score from the array data which is exactly the middle now if it is even number of observation then you expect that you have two middle score you just have to get the average like this one get the average of the two middle scores and then uh, there you go you will find its median so this is a very very quick uh, example of finding the median of a given data set. So that completes the series of um, measure of central tendency for ungrouped data. We did mean, median, and mode. So should you have any question and clarification for this video, please leave a question in the comment section. And that's it guys. Thank you so much for watching. See you around and please... Um, Keep posted by simply clicking the notification bell and also it will be much appreciated if you will subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys and be safe.